Andrew Pa, this is the Learn Cantonese Fast channel again. Uh, today I'm going to talk about conjunctions. So, uh, for, but then for this, I have two episodes because um, it's kind of too long. So today let me start with some uh, easier conju conjunctions or sometimes we call it connectors. Um, in other words, in Cantonese, we do not have, uh, what, it, what we, we do not distinguish between connect conjunctions and connectors. So we treat them as exactly the same thing. Right, so for example, conjunction, for example, here we have an, but then connector, connector we have moreover, right? But then in, in Cantonese, they're the same. Right, so and we use either tong mai or zhong yao, right? Either tong mai or zhong yao. Right, so for example, uh, she likes playing very much and she likes sleeping very much too. Right, tong mai, tong mai means Tong means identical. Tong mai means together. Right? And zhong yao zhong means still. Yao means have, still have. Right? So in this case, we use either tong mai or zhong yao for an. Okay? So how do we say uh, the, sen the sentence in Cantonese? Right? So here we have she koi very much ho like zhong yi play wan. Right? She very much like play. So, uh, and means sleep. means sleep. She very much like sleep. So, right, so but then normally we'll try to abbreviate. So, how do you abbreviate? So, in this case, uh, she likes play very much. She likes playing very much. So, you abbreviate by omitting. Right? For example, here we have. Well, but that's not uh, really too much abbreviation. So another version should be right, So she likes play and sleep very much. Right, and still even and even a, a shorter version will be Right, so you even skip the word my okay so and then we have another conjunction or right? or here we use wak right? so here we have an example uh, we we may go to eat or to watch a movie so how do you say it in Cantonese uh, we need we may may right? May is ho yi. Right? Sometimes we use can, uh, a uh, 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 yi for can. Right? But here we can also use may. Right? We we go, go to eat. Sick fun. Sick ye or sick ye or eat something. Sick ye. Okay. Or go to. Tai hei watch a movie. Right? Tai hei means watch movie. Right? So, ngo de ho yi. We may go ho yi. Sik ye or sik fan. I eat. Wak jie or ho yi tai hei. Here we can omit the, the word ho yi. Okay? So, ngo de ho yi ho yi sik fan. Wak jie tai hei. Which is also good. Uh, but then, when you try to ask a question using or you use another word, ding. Right? So if you try to ask a question here, okay? So if you want to try, you try to ask a question, if you use, if you want to incorporate the um, the word or you use ding instead of okay? Sometimes we say, okay? And how do you say either or in Cantonese? Uh, we use two yak hai. 
uh, yat hai this and then yat hai that. Right, so, uh, for example, you either go to sleep or continue to do your homework. Right, you either go to sleep or continue to do your homework. So, lei, you either yat hai go to sleep, hoi yu fan gao, or we, we don't even need to say or here. We say yat hai and then yat hai, okay? Yat hai, right, this or that. Lei yat hai hoi fan gao, yat hai gai juk zhou gong fo, continue. Uh, continues as uh, uh, Do jo homework kung for here you you can omit your because it's understood that you're doing your homework you're not you're not doing other people's homework okay jo kung for means you are doing your homework if you want to specify that someone is doing other people's homework you have to specify here right jo kui ge kung for for example right? you need to specify right? if you don't specify it means your your own your own homework right so let me repeat. 你一是去睡觉,一是继续做功课, do homework. Now they say, but, we use 但是, for example, she is very beautiful, but she also has a very bad temper. So here we say, 她是很漂亮, very beautiful. Ho means very beautiful is lang. Right? You you can skip it. you can skip hai. Right? So you can see you, you, normally you say koi ho lang. Koi hai ho lang is still okay, but it's not very. Is is well still okay, but it's not Cantonese. <laughs> so koi ho lang is enough. Koi ho lang tan hai, but koi chi pei hei temper. 好臭, uh, stinky, uh, very stinky means very bad. Or 好差, uh, uh, means means the level is, is low, uh, it's not good. It's 佢好靚, uh, she is beautiful, but 但是佢, temper, uh, her temper, uh, 佢脾氣, 佢脾氣, her temper is very stinky. Uh, 好差, 好臭, okay. Okay, so you, you can see that there is no hai, okay, it's even though we use is or has, has means yao, okay. And then how do you say even though or although? Well, here we don't really say even though or although in Cantonese, we use dan hai, right? But then if you really want to say it, you can use the more Mandarin kind of, of phrase, sui uh, yin, dan hai, right? But here you can actually skip sui yin. Right. So uh, you, you you use in other words you use exactly the same sentence structure as here. Right. So even though she is beautiful, she uh, also has a very uh, so also has a very bad temper. You can say something like "koi ho lang dan hai." Okay. And how about when and while? Well, normally you you you're talking about uh, the timing of something happening. Right. So "go zhan" "go." that moment right. Hang, uh, at at that moment okay. at that moment something happened uh, some other thing is happening also okay so in Mandarin you say tong uh, you can also say tong in Cantonese but it's not really that Cantonese okay so normally people will say something like this uh, for example while you were eating he came in lei you second eating. 嗰陣, 嗰陣 means at that moment, right? He, in, came in, came in, is the past tense, uh, means something, the action is over, right? So he came in, right? you eating at that moment, he, came in. Uh, uh, and then how do you say how do you say uh, how do you say unless uh, normally we use chui fei uh, for example unless you are the best in the class uh, your father will not buy any toy for you. Uh, so uh, so this is the condition that you have to satisfy otherwise uh, your father will not be buying any toy for you. That's uh, so how do you say in Cantonese Cantonese uh, lei uh, your father, uh, 你老豆, 老豆 is father, uh, will not 
um, we, uh, remember we means you have a high, very high, high, very, very high probability or uh, the chances is very high. Um, we means there is no chance, okay? So your father will have no chance, right? 你老豆不会 买, buy, 野玩, uh, toy, uh, toy is 野玩, for you, uh, 给你, uh, give it to you, right? 不会买野玩给你 Your father will not buy toy for you 除非, unless 除非 you are the best in class 你考第一 考第一 means your exam result is, the, is, the, is number one 考第一 你老豆不会买野给你玩 除非你考第一 Okay, so can you reverse the order? Which is not that good. Okay, so uh, it's, it's much better for you to say 你老豆不会买给你玩 除非你考第一 And how, this, how do you say before in Cantonese? Before is 之前 okay, So for example, before she comes, we should not begin to eat uh, 她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去她去